Um, today we are here to report to the general public about um, a situation that had happened at um, um, Brusubi um, in recent during these recent days. Um, that is a breaking and, a st and stealing incident in which um, um, four individuals um, by the name um, Ismail Ature and Baba Jaite, and we have also Wee Sani as well as Mohammed Kohli. They are the suspects that you have seen outside there. Um, these individuals have broken into an office premises and have decided to um, steal all those flat screen televisions that you have seen outside. They are 16 number and they have gone with them. Um, the good thing is um, the people who own this office have been able to put up a proper security in place and so they were able to provide the police with evidence that helped the police so much in this investigation. The police have taken time to go through this evidential material, they've reviewed it and, and through that review they were able to identify the four suspects and they have spent the whole night rounding them off from one spot to the other until all of them have been arrested. So far so good, all the flat screen televisions that they have stolen have all been recovered and those are the ones that you have seen outside there. And so um, equally an important aspect of the investigation is the fact that these flat screens have been recovered from somebody who has bought them all at $60,000. Now what we, the interesting thing here is that um, the value of this property as far as the owner has put to the police is up to $400,000. But when we investigate we realize that um, this person who bought it from the, um, from the boys only bought it at the cost of $60,000. And so therefore, um, our message to the general public is this. One, um, we want the public to um, report as quick as possible when breaking um, or related offenses takes, took, um, takes place at their premises so that this helps the police to quickly intervene. And secondly, for people to share in, uh, information with the police because um, it is only through collaboration and partnership that we can be able to deal with these situations. And we always say um, we try as much as possible to prevent crime, but where we cannot prevent crime, we want to ensure that people who perpetrate crime are arrested and brought to justice. And the third thing that we want to put across is for, to encourage people to also put in some security measures at their premises because this also will help a lot in ensuring that the investigations are easier for the police as well. And finally, we want to let the public understand that these people who have been arrested have all been charged with breaking and stealing. They've also been charged with conspiracy to commit felony and some of them have been charged with um, receiving a stolen property as well as accessory to the fact. And so all this um, um, situation right now is under the purview of the police anti-crime unit. The files have been reviewed and they are getting ready um, to put them before the court as soon as possible.